Hi, I'm Fred and I'm learning to make by watching tons of videos and pouring them all through my eye holes and into my brain bucket. Today in Fed's Tool Corner, I'm going to talk about my new bandsaw, a WEN Model 3939T. Hi, I'm Fed. Ouch. I've got a new tool. Uh, I've always wanted to have a bandsaw and um, now I have one. I got a really cheap one. Uh, this is a WEN 3939T bandsaw. I like the model number. To me, it sounds like it's straight out of Star Wars. Maybe it's because it ends with T, and I'm thinking of the... <laughs> Nothing fancy, cost about $175, I think, when I bought it. Um, you might be able to get it for cheaper now, I'm not sure. This is an updated version of a model that's been on Amazon for a long time, um, which uh, was around 100 and you can get it for as low as $130. So this is not a high-end bandsaw. I didn't need or want a high-end bandsaw. I don't have the room for it. I wanted a bench top bandsaw that I could just use for cutting a few things. I've been wanting a bandsaw for a while. It's not a tool I expect to use all the time, but there are some tasks that a bandsaw does a lot better than anything else. I did my usual web research, watched lots of YouTube bandsaw videos, and read lots of Amazon reviews, and two when bandsaws kept coming up the model 3959 and the 3939T. They're both nine inch bandsaws and nine inches refers to the, uh, as I learned, the distance between the blade and the arm of the bandsaw. In other words, the widest piece of wood or whatever that you could cut. The 3939T is a newer model of bandsaw with a slightly more powerful motor and a longer saw blade, but is otherwise very similar to the older 3959. So because I like newer things, I guess, and they supposedly made some improvements, I went ahead and bought myself the 3939T. I found the WEN bandsaw came with a clear manual and was very easy to assemble. The saw comes mostly ready from the factory, mostly. All you have to do is attach the top plate and align it with the square and a set of pliers, such as these pliers, Bremen. Given the price point, I wasn't surprised to find a few rough edges, such as these rough edges. Apart from holes in the case, I found parts covered with metal filings and scratches on the cutting table, but there were a few good things too. A couple of knowledgeable reviewers on Amazon taught me that this bandsaw comes with blade guide bearings, I think that's the name. Apparently it makes the blade run straighter and smoother. It comes with a safety switch, a nice fence, an okay miter gauge, but I think all miter gauges that come with any kind of power tool are just okay. A little blade brush, a two and a half inch vacuum port, and crowned tires. That last one sounds really fancy. Oh, hello! Uh, but it refers to the rubber around the blade wheels inside. They keep the blade from getting worn on the metal wheel and it makes for a better cut. And you might be thinking, oh, he probably wants to cut like wood or, you know, for his wood projects or things like that. Well, yes, eventually. But really, the reason that I got it was because I bought these for my dog. And my dog is a senior dog. And um, these are too big for her mouth. And um, I wanted something to cut them with. I tried cutting them with a handsaw and it took forever and um, it was really messy and gross. So I decided it was time for me to get a bandsaw so that I could cut my dog's treats. That sounds like I made it up, but it uh, doesn't actually take me a lot to justify getting a new tool. And um, this was a good enough reason. Safety first.
So there you have it, my first impressions of the Wen 3939T bandsaw. Um, for the 15 minutes that I used it, I thought it was great. Do I recommend it? Sure. <laughs> it seems fine. <laughs> Don't buy it because it's it's it sounds like it could come out of Star Wars. That's not a good reason to buy tools. Not that I need better reasons. This came highly regarded, especially for the price. It's not too big, it's not too small. It appears to be well enough powered. It's got enough amps and horsepowers. This is my third or fourth WEN product and I've been happy with all of them. They're all budget products, but they work well. They do the job that uh, I wanted them to do. And for a little hobby workshop, this is perfect. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, like, subscribe, share, do all that stuff, all that YouTube stuff. Um, and I will see you around for more videos like this or build projects, whatever I, uh, I do. Talk to you later. Bye.